Good morning, Fall City Middle School. It is Tuesday, December 14th. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Okay, everybody. So today we are having pizza, lettuce salad, pears, chocolate pudding, and a milk for lunch. Happy, legitimate, real birthday to Xavier Ebel. Xavier, I hope you have a great day. Enjoy your pizza on Fall City Middle School. And I hope you have a great day. Maybe mom will make you a cake or something. All right. 12 days of Christmas. Yesterday was holiday headwear. Today is wear white, dream of a white Christmas. It doesn't feel like a white Christmas outside. It's pretty nice. And tomorrow is Whoville Crazy Hair Day, which is pretty much every day for me if I wear my stocking hat. So tomorrow, crazy day or crazy hair day. And today is wear white. Got an announcement from Ms. Vertisca and Circle of Friends. Seventh grade Circle of Friends will be meeting in the makerspace on Friday during homeroom. So keep that in mind. Our AOK -okay of the day is going from Mr. Rolf out to Austin Munford. Uh, Austin was helping a fellow student in science and he because he couldn't see the board. So great job, Austin. That's coming out from Mr. Rolf. So good work, Austin Munford. And finally, almost finally, before our words of wisdom, just want to point out I was going to be joined today by my friend Raider Fan for announcements. But I could not find a brown paper bag to wear on my head, and I was going to write Raider Fan on it, because that's what Raider Fan's doing now. If you are a Raider Fan, or any football fan, it's never a good idea to stomp on somebody's logo, and then go out and get blown out by 48 points, or 40 points, or whatever it was. Uh, not a good idea. If you're going to talk smack, you better back it up. They didn't back it up. So, anyway, Donkey fans, be grateful. Don't stomp on the Chiefs logo. That's not going to go well for you. All right. And our words of wisdom. Maybe that's my words of wisdom. Don't stomp on somebody's logo if you're not going to win. Um, but for real, here are your words of wisdom. If you were arrested for kindness, would there be enough evidence to convict you? What do you bring to your interactions with classmates, friends, and family? Is it encouragement, optimism, or kind words? Or is it pessimism, criticism, and cynicism? People often forget what we say, and usually what we do, but as Maya Angelou said, they always remember how you made them feel. In our quest of making and keeping friends, we first need to be a friend in order to obtain friends. So start off by being more kind. Live by Brian Tracy's words for us today. You will regret many things in life, but you will never regret being too kind or too fair. With something to think about, it's Mr. Bangert. Make it a great day or not, the choice is always yours. And yes... I did lose to Miss Milam in fantasy this week. I just feel like I need to throw that out there because that's me being kind because usually I'm not kind when I destroy Miss Milam. So, Miss Milam, enjoy it. You won. Hopefully you make the playoffs and knock Mr. Dunkus out. That would be great. Have a great day, everybody, and I will see you all tomorrow.